11 incredible new space discoveries. Number 11, the farthest galaxy. March of 2016 was filled with new space discoveries, and one of them being that the Hubble Space Telescope measured a new record of cosmic distance set by the farthest galaxy named GN-Z11. The galaxy was created about 400 million years after the Big Bang, and so the light that scientists are just now seeing is from over 13 billion years ago. That means the galaxy already looks completely different from what we're seeing kind of like time traveling. Number 10, a real life Death Star. Astronomers caught this real life Death Star destroying a planetismal, a small dwarf planet, asteroid, or moon earlier this year back in March. This new finding is said to possibly be able to help learn how dead stars tear their planetary systems apart, such as the same fate that will eventually happen to our sun and the surrounding planets. The Death Star is a white dwarf star it was named WD 1145-017 that can be found in the Virgo constellation some 570 light years away from Earth. White dwarfs occur when the stars have completely depleted their fuel supply and an Earth-sized core of dead stars is left in its place. Number 9. A Supernova Shockwave Scientists were able to view the emitting shockwave of a supernova explosion for the first time ever back in March of this year thanks to the Kepler Space Telescope. The star that ended itself in a fiery blaze of glory was named KSN 2011D and was located approximately 1.2 billion light years away from Earth. The star had a diameter that rivaled our suns. It was around 500 times larger. Supernovas occur when a star reaches its last stage and can emit a blast with a brightness of 10 billion suns. There are five types of supernovae and are split into two groups the ones that show signs of hydrogen, and those who don't show signs of hydrogen at all. The capturing of this occurrence was quite rare, considering that supernovas go off unpredictably. Number 8. A Planetary Hall It was announced by astronomers back on May 10th of this year that NASA's Kepler Space Telescope had made a whopping discovery. It managed to locate 1,284 new exoplanets and bring up the known total from 1,916 to 3,200 and is directly responsible for finding 2,235 of those exoplanets. This makes the total increase of known alien planets rise to a 60% increase. Nine of those exoplanets are said to perhaps support the quality of life. There are at least 7 billion main sequence stars in the galaxy, so there could be a strong possibility that we might not really be the only ones out here. But then again, no one knows for sure. Only time will tell. Number seven, a new dwarf planet. The new dwarf planet named 2015 RR245 was spotted way back in February earlier this year as part of the ongoing Outer Solar System Origin Survey and is located in the Kuiper Belt much further away than the planet Pluto. It takes Pluto 248 Earth years to make a full trip around the sun, but it takes the new dwarf planet a staggering 700 Earth years for it to complete a lap. This is quite exciting for astronomers to study because of its relatively large size compared to all the other smaller objects located in the Kuiper Belt. The planet is set to make its closest approach to the sun in 2096. Number 6. A triple star system. Last month in July, researchers found a new planet that simultaneously orbits three stars at once in a triple star system. The new planet, titled HD 131399AB, is located in the constellation Centaurus, which is approximately 340 light years from Earth. Scientists have calculated that if someone were to look up from the planet, three orbiting stars would appear as full and bright as the full moon does here on Earth. As a point of reference, star A is about 80% larger and almost eight times brighter than our own sun. The stars are visible for only 550 Earth years of the planet's orbit, which means a full orbit is 1,100 Earth years. This new find shows that planets are able to exist in different layouts than what is believed. 
Number five, the expansion of the universe. A couple of months ago, it was announced that researchers had discovered that the universe is expanding at a much faster rate than what was initially thought. They were able to determine that its expansion is around five to 9% greater than what was previously expected. The rate of the universe's expansion is known as the Hubble constant, named after the famous American astronomer Edwin Hubble, which is now at a value of 45.5 miles per second per megaparsec. And to give a better understanding, a megaparsec is the equivalence of 3.26 million light years. This could help aid in the understanding of materials such as dark matter, dark energy, and dark radiation. Number four, a white dwarf time bomb. This alluring image was captured by the Hubble telescope that depicts the aftermath of an exploding white dwarf. The star had detonated 160,000 light years away, and what we can see are the hot gases being blasted throughout space. Now this supernova wasn't caused by the star running out of hydrogen, as is the case with half of supernova explosions, but rather as a result of stealing. That's right, the white dwarf was on its way to burning out when it managed to steal the neighboring gases from a nearby star and create a new outer layer in the process. This made the star grow and become too unstable, resulting in a massive eruption. Number three, twin stars. It was discovered in late 2014 that what astronomers initially believed was one giant mass was really two separate stars that were orbiting each other very closely at a speed of 621,000 miles per hour. The two blue stars, both named Mycamelopardalis, have been identified as being incredibly much younger. They're only two million years old than most of the other formed stars and are each roughly 30 times bigger than our sun. This is one of the largest binary star systems that we know of. These two stars are Set to eventually collide and form one giant star, which is how scientists believe a lot of the older stars in the universe came to be. However, no one knows when. Number two, Dragonfly 44. What separates this galaxy from our very own Milky Way is that astronomers have discovered that it is almost entirely made up of dark matter, 99.99% of it to be exact. For those of you who don't know, dark matter is an invisible and mysterious material that has puzzled scientists for years. They aren't quite sure what it is, but they believe it's real because of the effects its gravity has on the other things in space, and it makes up about 80% of the universe. The galaxy was first spotted back in 2015 with the help of the Dragonfly Telephoto Array in New Mexico that is able to look at objects in space that aren't bright enough for other telescopes. The array achieves this by using a combination of eight telephoto lenses and cameras. Number one, Centauri B. Astronomers have recently discovered that there is an Earth-sized planet that lies orbiting the red dwarf star known as Proxima Centauri. The planet dubbed as Centauri B is located 4.2 light years from our own solar system and is said to be found in the star's habitable zone. Researchers have been trying to look for planets near Proxima Centauri for the last 15 years, but have had no such luck until now. How did this planet go undetected for so long when astronomers have found other planets that are located even further than Centauri B? The reason is said to be sparse sampling and the longer term variability of the star. Either way, scientists are now going to focus their efforts to see if there is any potential here to support life.